everyone, we're going to evaluate the limit using the table of Maclaurin series. So for arc 10, we're just going to write this as um, arc 10. It's pretty much, I'll write it so you can see it better. This is x minus x cubed divided by 3 plus x to the power of 5 divided by 5 minus x to the power of 7 divided by 7 and so on. <coughs> and cosine of x equals 1 minus x squared divided by 2 factorial plus x to the fourth power divided by 4 factorial minus and so on. Alright, so let's just fill everything in, see what we have. We're going to take the limit as x approaches uh, 0, and let's substitute our arc 10 as x minus x cubed divided by 3 plus x to the 5th divided by 5 minus x to the 7th divided by 7. Then we have minus x times our cosine, and the cosine is 1 minus x squared divided by 2 factorial. Um, plus x to the fourth power, but at four factorial, minus dot, dot, dot. And then um, we still have our minus one divided by six x cubed. All right, and this is all divided by x to the power of five. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and simplify the uh, numerator. And we're going to get uh, the limit as x approaches 0 of uh, x minus x cubed divided by 3 plus x to the power of 5 divided by 5 plus dot dot dot. This should actually be a minus, but it doesn't really matter. All right, and then we have minus x plus x cubed divided by 2 minus x to the power of 5 divided by 24 plus dot 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 minus 1 divided by 6 x cubed all divided by x to the power of 5. Alright, so what we can cancel out, we can cancel these two out. Also these cubes, if you look at these, the common denominator is 6 and if you get the common denominator, that's going to be negative 2x cubed plus 3x cubed. So this is going to be 1 divided by 6x cubed. So these are going to cancel out with this. So what we're left with is the limit as x approaches a 0 of x to the power of 5 divided by 5 minus x to the power of 5 divided by 24 um, plus all your higher order terms. Remember, um, just put the higher order divided by x to the power of 5. Now, basically, what we're doing is we're going to divide each piece by um, x to the fifth. So we're really just multiply the numerator by x to the fifth and your denominator by x to the fifth. And that's going to give you the limit as x approaches 0 of 1 divided by 5 minus 1 divided by 24 because these higher order terms here are going to go away. All right, they're just going to disappear, and that's what you're going to get. So this is really going to be common denominator is 120. So this is uh, 24 minus 5, which equals 19 divide it by 120. And that is your uh, limit. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.